Hello, tutorial shows you how to boot from USB. 4 easy ways to boot USB Windows 10. Steps in the tutorial. First, how to boot from USB using CMD Windows command prompt. Second, how to boot from USB using shortcut. Third, how to boot from USB using Windows 10 settings. Fourth, how to boot from USB by holding down the shift key until the computer restarts. Step 1, how to boot from USB using CMD Windows command prompt. First of all, connect your bootable USB flash drive to your computer's USB port. As you can see, my bootable USB is already connected. Then open Windows Command Prompt as an administrator. Type shutdown slash question mark. and hit enter. It displays a complete list of shutdown command options. So, if we type slash r, after shutdown command, it's full shutdown and restarts the computer. Next, we need slash o, go to the advanced boot options menu and restart the computer. And slash t, it's optional, you can set the timeout period before shutdown. Let's clear the command prompt and try to combine the Windows commands that boot from USB. So, type shutdown slash R slash O slash T and let's say 10 seconds. Hit enter. Wait 10 seconds. And you will get Windows Advanced Boot Options menu. Go to Use Device. Then, EFI USB device. If you see your bootable USB flash drive name on the blue screen, that means legacy support is enabled in your BIOS. And you can boot USB with legacy mode. But I recommend to boot USB with the EFI option. So, click on EFI USB device. And wait until your USB boots. Done, we have boot from USB using CMD Windows command prompt. If you get a boot error, EFI USB device has been blocked by the current security policy. Don't worry, you can find an easy fix below in the description. Okay, let's cancel bootable USB and go to the second method. Step 2, how to boot from USB using shortcut. Let's create a new shortcut. Right click on the desktop. Select new. And choose shortcut. Type shutdown. Slash R. Slash O. Slash T. And seconds, it's up to you. Click Next. Enter the name of the shortcut, I name it Boot from USB. And click Finish, to create the Boot from USB button. Then we need to make some important changes in Boot from USB shortcut. Right click on Boot from USB and go to Properties. Optionally, you can change the Boot from USB icon. Make sure you are on Shortcut tab. And click on Advanced. 
check the Run as Administrator checkbox and click OK. Then apply and OK to save changes. Boot from USB shortcut is ready to use, so let's check it out. Go to Use Device. Then, EFI USB Device. And wait until your USB boots. Done. We have boot from USB using shortcut. Okay, let's cancel bootable USB and go to the third method. Step 3, how to boot from USB using Windows 10 settings. Click on Windows icon. And go to Settings. Click on Update and Security. Go to Recovery. Under Advanced Startup, click Restart Now. Go to Use Device. Then, EFI USB device and wait until your USB boots done we have boot from USB using Windows 10 settings okay let's cancel bootable USB and go to the fourth method step 4 how to boot from USB by holding down the shift key until the computer restarts Press and hold the shift key on the keyboard. And then restart the computer. Continue to hold down shift until the blue screen with the choose an option appears on your computer. Go to use device. Then, EFI USB device. And wait until your USB boots. Done. We have boot from USB by holding down the shift key until the computer restarts. Okay, we have successfully boot from USB with 4 easy ways. Thanks for watching, if that sounds like something that could help you, then make sure to join me, subscribe to my channel with notification, and be the first, who get more great tips and tricks.